Welcome back to the Chaos Wheel franchise. All right, Wheel, give me a challenge or something here. Fire, coach! Okay, Sean McVay, you're canned. Sorry, Sean. This is just how the cookie crumbles. You fired. Firing in the middle of the season seems to have a huge negative for us because a lot of these guys don't have any talents. Tommy Blazer sounds like a cool name, though. You're higher. All right, spin number two. Oh, that's a stinky one. Minus 10 overall for a random player? This has just been ruthless already to my team. Which position will it be? It's only my punter. That's the best thing that could have happened. That guy already stinks. I mean, Burt's already 68 overall. It's not like he was that great to begin with. We'll just make him even worse. That didn't take long at all. Just lower his awareness and he's there. Spin number three. Oh, this looks impossible. Must lateral to score. I've been seeing this all in the comments. You guys are the one who got it onto the wheel. And I tell you what, I've been terrified of this one. To try and lateral every time we score, I guess I want to make sure we have good outside run blocking. So I'm going to stick to that. So I think I know a way around this challenge, though. It sounds difficult in theory, but I think all I really have to do is go out of bounds if I'm about to score and I don't have anyone to lateral to. I don't have to lateral every single play, only when I need to. This challenge sounds scary in theory, but I ain't stressing. Oh! I'm liking the Lonnie Bacon in one-on-one -on -one coverage! Oh my goodness. And off the flash. Dude, the offense is already getting it in gear. I'm gonna take off with Brett. He's got the side right here. Can he keep running? Remember, I have to go out of bounds because we have to pitch it to score. To try and simplify this challenge, I use the Baltimore Ravens playbook. It has a lot of option plays in there. And triple option is gonna be our main way we get into the end zone. So we're just going to ignore that. Go straight to this one, pitching it. Flash Williams, can he get there? Oh, he's up to the one. Pitch it. There it is. Yes, it worked. Touchdown. So we've pitched it twice and both had success. But if we want the two-point conversion, we also have to pitch it. We didn't even get rid of it. I told him to push it. Okay, that's fine. We got a touchdown. That's already big. Oh, that's a pick for Tony McTwist. Well, it took us two plays and we already got the football back. Flash Williams is going to be getting quite a few touchdowns today. Pitch that. Oh! It's got to be holding, right? Is this one coming back? Yep. Got to take off with him again. This one's not going to work. A well, fourth and 13. We can't kick field goals anyway, so might as well try and throw for it. Go up and get that. It's going to be just swatted down. Turnover on downs. Nice swat out. The defense has been on it. We're in Daniel Jones' face. He's throwing it on the run. He throws a dime. Oh, I'll take that one. Another interception for our defense. Daniel Jones is just gifting us these. Let's throw the ball while we still have some space. Oh, I got rid of it too late. Oh, look, at he's so wide open. Mickey Bowes. I kind of love that play. Let's try it again. Oh, I got his. I threw it, but Mickey Bowes was about to be open again. Sacked again. I have been off my game. Is he going to be open? Oh, he just stopped running. That's very upsetting. Oh, they're starting to pick it up now. Ooh, he burned me on the route, but Daniel Jones missed him. To the corner. He missed him again. That'll have them lining up for the field goal. He gets it, so we just have a three-point lead. Dude, we just turn this into a pass and launch it to Mickey Bowes? I think we do. Or just run it, because I was getting attacked in the backfield. I'll take four yards. This one's for Flash. And that'll move the sticks. Oh, that's a beautiful ball. And Darren Root, who hasn't seen the field in a while, is making a great catch. Oh, he came off the edge. I did not see him. I should have had the running back blocking. Flash needs to stay in and block here. Throw the ball. Oh, it's broken up again. It's going to be another turnover. This is spookier than I wanted it to be. Ooh, good try for the pick. I know it was like sailing way over your head, though. I don't think you were going to get that one. Oh, you should have gone for the pick. He swats it down instead. I wonder what they're going to do here. It's fourth and one. A very short one at that. They will actually punt it, and it's going to go out of bounds. So we got another chance. How we make it lateral, I don't know. Is there a hook and ladder play in this game? Not that I'm aware of. Okay, we'll try this. Everyone just crossing over each other. 
<laughs> Super crowded. I don't know how he caught that. Oh, he's open! Oh, I got hit as I threw it! It's not like we could get into the end zone with that, but we could have tried. Oh, no catch here. Brutal half. I still, like, am surprised we got that first touchdown. Oh, no, there goes Saquon. Somebody tackle this man. Plugging that hole up. No, he's breaking tackles again. Can I get there? I'm making the tackle. Got to hold him to a field goal if possible. Nobody's on him. Touchdown. Uh-oh. Give an outside toss a try. Oh, he breaks one. Flash has not had enough carries today. Got to keep him in the mix. Oh, he's got X Factor enabled. Oh, he's so open. Lonnie Bacon has nobody on him. Is somebody back here to catch a pitch? No, they would just pick that off. So we'll just take the big game for Lonnie. So a pitch, I am not going to count as like a lateral. I'm going to say I have to do it in mid play. So it has to be like, uh, we'll say triple option can count. Ooh, mm -hmm. holding. Did I not score? It's a flag anyway on us. Holding. Offense. Weird. Stay with me, Flash. Go, Flash. Oh, back up to the eight yard line. Get rid of it. Flash has it. Juke the guy out. We're up to the three. This has been surprisingly effective. Oh yes, we've got it. Flash in the end zone, touchdown. He has been the hero of the episode. Now can we get the two point conversion? Oh, it's a flag. I don't think they'll make us redo it. I think they'll just decline it. Yep. I feel like I never see holding calls, but I guess in these type of plays, they make sure it happens way more often. I guess they don't want you to just abuse options the entire game. Oh, <laughs> super late hit. Daniel Jones is keeping it. Oh no. Where is everybody? He's gone. 65 yards to the house. That did not go as intended. So they're up by five points now. Oh, what a block. Hugh Janus. That's a big time run. 31 yards. Flash still has his X Factor enabled and it's bright red. I don't know what that means, but he's going off. He's still moving. They're all over us. It's fourth down now. Fullback dive for the first. Who says no? Get there. Way to go, Kyle. It's picked off. Oh, no. We've been pitching it all this time. We thought we could get away with it easily. And they just pick off the lateral. <laughs> Bringing him in the air and tackling him. I didn't mention it at the beginning of the video, but this is a must-win game. We're nearing playoff time, and we only got two games left in the year. No! There's no shot Eric Tyson misses that. Nobody's there. That stinks. Auto calling timeouts because my guys are hurt. I think we just lost. Stop him there, but we only got one timeout left. I mean, he just finds the hole every time. Might as well let him go. So painful. And we're down by 12. We need some miracles. Oh, he threw an absolute missile. Damn it. Hit him in stride. Johnny Walker, get us up to the one or something. Tackled, pushed out of bounds. Good. This is in range to where we can lateral it and hopefully get a touchdown. Oh, just got it away. Oh my goodness, they almost intercepted it again, but this was a touchdown. That was so close. I'm telling you, we had to finesse the angle on that one, but we made it work. Two-point conversion makes this so close. Gets it away, and Flash is going to get it. Let's go. We're still in this ball game. We've gotten some of these before, but it's always pure luck. Yep, that's going to do it. Dying right there in the water. <laughs> yeah. Got a new head coach in here. He was not able to win the game for us. I'm really depressed, man. We lost the game because they intercepted the pitch. This video is brought to you by Underdog. Underdog is a fantasy sports app that is famous for their pickums. The pickums are simple. You make two picks at higher or lower, and you could end up winning big. The more picks you make, the higher the payout will be. But if you got a lot of picks and you're worried about not all of them hitting, you can lower the payout for insurance. Really cool feature. The pickums I like for Monday night are Dalton Kincaid higher 
higher than 0.5 rushing or receiving touchdowns. Will Lutz higher than 1.5 field goals made. Josh Allen higher than 0.5 rushing touchdowns or receiving touchdowns. Jaleel McLaughlin higher than 1.5 receptions. You can find these picks or any other on Underdog and you can use the link in the description and make sure to use code NTE. If it's your first time downloading Underdog, they will actually match your first deposit up to $100. It also helps out the channel directly when you sign up, so make sure you use code NTE. New customers are revealed a mystery pick'em special. These are usually very awesome, like a star quarterback at higher or lower than 0.5 total yards. So take advantage of those. Playing Underdog Fantasy and Pick'ems makes watching sports even more entertaining. So thanks again to Underdog for sponsoring this video. Okay, we had to lateral in our first game. What about this one? Ooh, signing a backyard football legend. That one's fun. It's gonna be interesting seeing one of these kids grow up. Which one is it gonna give it to us? Pete Wheeler, that's a good one. He's got insane speed. I wanna play the football. He's perfect. Get him on the team. So Pete did not have a specific position, so I can put him wherever I feel like, which is nice. The thing is about Pete is he's very fast, but the downside of him is he's like pretty mid or bad at other things. So like, yes, he is going to be extremely fast for a tight end, but his catching is mid and his blocking stats are just straight up bad <laughs> and for some reason he has uh cole beasley's face so we'll just edit in pete wheeler's face on top of it so that's a fun pickup for us what else is gonna get us from the wheel here fix one game so we have to give one win to a divisional opponent totally random well that's not ideal anyone but the 49ers anyone but the 49ers Woo! it's the seahawks i kind of wish it went to the cardinals but that's fine so I have to force a win for the Seahawks. That is really unfortunate for us. But if it was the 49ers, we'd basically be out of playoff contention. At least this way we have a chance. Still haven't gotten a challenge yet, and this is our third wheel spin. Oh, that stinks. Running backs, minus 25 carrying. Flash Williams, minus 25 carrying. It's going to get him down to 65 carrying. And that drops his overall quite significantly. Hugh Janus from 87 to 62. And Tarfasia Hollow from 80 all the way down to 55. Spin number four. Defensive line plus 10 block shed. All right, that's a balance it out. I feel like those defensive line upgrades were much needed. We gave up a ton of yards to Saquon Barkley last game. This is spin number five. Still haven't got a challenge. Oh, but here it is right here. Option plays only. Well, we started off lateraling it all the time, and now we're gonna do some more of it. It looks like the 49ers have not clinched the division yet. We are one game behind them, and this is the final game of the season. I think because we beat them earlier on in the year, the tiebreaker would mean that if we win this game, we win the division and we go on to the playoffs. I'm telling you, we play in the worst division of all time. A team with a losing record will be going to the playoffs. Which is crazy to think about. Oh my gosh! Are we gonna do it? On the opening kickoff! Who needs option plays? Because we have to do a kick return at some point, right? Goodell Slayer takes it the distance in a must-win game. And Pete Wheeler is right next to him. Man found a hole up the middle. I'll allow it. Simply because I can't call an option play on a kick return. Nope. But I can do it on the two-point conversion. Timeout. Thankfully, this time around, I do not have to do triple option exclusively. Hand off. Oh, that didn't work out at all. We really destroyed Brock Purdy the last time we played him super early on in the season. Can we do it again here? But Christian McCaffrey is the one we have to watch out for. Eric Tyson's already making big plays. Ooh, out of reach. Brock Purdy's messing up again. In his face. I hit him. And he had to throw it out of bounds. It's going to be a tremendous amount of rushing yards this game because that's all we can do. I mean, Flash is doing pretty well so far. Pete Wheeler at fullback. Toss that over to Flash. He's used to this one. Oh, got hit in the back. Fumble. Flash scoops it up. That was lucky. That is one downside of the triple option. That's why it is much safer to do just read options. So I might just rely on those more often. Most of these are going to flash. I dig that. Well, we can't punt it. We have to go for it on fourth down. Unless there's an option play in the special teams playbook I don't know about. Pete! Got nowhere. Oh, Eric Tyson's taking over this game. And we're in his face and we're going to sack him. Tossing it out to flash. Oh, he breaks one. 
It seems like he breaks one tackle every single play. You know what, Brett? You just take off right up the middle. He breaks one. I love a little option offense. This is one of those challenges that are just a good time. Pete out to the corner. Pete, get the sidelines up to the eight yard line. What a time to add a player to the team. Pete Wheeler using the wheels. Ooh. Didn't pitch it in time and I was slamming the button. I feel like you have to be all the way out in space for it to kick in. Oh, able to slip through. Nice play, Pete. Keeper for the quarterback, hopping over. He's getting into the end zone, touchdown. I'm having fun with this challenge. Now can we get the two point conversion? This one's for Flash. He's got the blocks, he's got it. Uh oh, so untackle McCaffrey. He's so dang fast. Oh, Brock Purdy's keeping it. What kind of play are they running? They saw that we were having so much fun with the option. They said, let's give it a shot ourselves. Oh, you just let him have that. Threw that up for grabs. Brandon Ayuk's just too good. Okay, get to the quarterback. We're going to put all the pressure on him. It's going to be a screen pass. I ran into my own dudes. Pistol Lincoln diving, missing. They get a touchdown. Pitch it out to Flash. I mean, come on. I was slamming the button. And we have to do it. We have to go for it. That's the challenge. Five yards is quite a lot to get, but we have no choice. Flash. He's going to be stuffed short. We got the pressure on him, and he's not going to make a clean throw. Oh, strip sack. Get the football. Brock Purdy falls on it. Throwing it up for grabs, and he's not going to complete it. Our pressure has been getting to Brock Purdy. Oh, he shanked it. We pushed him back far enough to where it was a difficult field goal, and he missed it. Ooh. Okay, they're all over him. Pitch it now! It's on the ground! That's so bad. If he caught it, that would have been a touchdown. How do we mess up the exchange? Devastating, man. I saw the end zone. And Pete's gonna be tackled here. That's gonna be halftime. So lame. That's a user sack! They didn't have anybody back there blocking for him. Oh, they tried to do a sneaky handoff, and we're all over that one. Quarterback keeper. And we got a penalty. Boo. We would have taken it the distance. Why do we have to be holding? And move us all the way back to the 18 yard line. Maybe we'll do it this time. We got a block upfield. Oh, we just did it back to back on him. How about that? Suck on those eggs, 49ers. And the refs meet Mr. Brett Belushi. Oh my goodness, it's been automatic for us. We've run it three times and gotten points out of every single one. Uh-oh. Christian McCaffrey breaks off one of those like every couple of plays. That's an excellent block for him. And they're going to score off of that. Let's see if it works for a fourth time. Oh my goodness. Is this play just broken? Brett still running. It's had tremendous success. I'll try a different play for once. But I mean, we did it four times in a row and every single time had success. Nowhere to run here. Oh my god. I mean, there's pancakes everywhere for us. Blocks downfield. This is too easy. We're going to get like 300 rushing yards with Brett Blushy if this is the case. It's so funny to me. You discover things in these like football video games, especially in Madden. Like when you find a broken play, it's like you could run that all game if you really wanted to. And I already know that play read option out of the pistol with the tight ends blocking. It's broken. Oops. I did not mean to kick a field goal. Whatever. <laughs> Get him. Eric Tyson forcing a fumble. Are we really not going to fall on that, guys? I was about to say. Get up, Cookman. All right, we'll, we'll try this play one last time. If it works again, then it's official. They need to patch this play. All right, that time it actually gave us a different read. Perfect pitch. And Pete Wheeler's going to get himself a touchdown. <laughs> I kind of like the celebration here. Spider-Man meme type thing. I accidentally kicked a field goal my last go around, so I'm going to have to just punt this one on purpose. And Brett just run backwards and fumble it. That works too. You know what? If they return it, I'll allow it. But they didn't. They just fell on it. Oh my goodness. We didn't even cover George Kittle. 
Another touchdown in this one for Christian McCaffrey again. Oh, Brett's crazy with it. 216 rushing yards for him. Oh, Flash used the green grass. This one's going to be a touchdown too. This is one of our most high-powered offenses we've ever had. And I haven't even run that many option plays so far in this game. But I'm having fun today. That one fails, but we got a 20-point lead this late into the fourth quarter. I'm happy. I'm not happy with Zach Martin bruising his sternum, though. Yeah, he's got nothing again lobbing this out of bounds. No way he catches that. Tony McSwift with his third sack of the game. Hitting that one away, and that's going to be ball game. <laughs> what was that picture of Brock? Looking crazy. Mission accomplished. Came in here running only option plays and we succeeded. Grabbing the win and I hope, crossing my fingers, that we win the division. We beat the 49ers twice this year. We both have the same record. Surely that is enough to bump us up. My goodness, Brett Blushy averaged 16 yards a carry. That's obscene. And we did it. With that victory, we just snuck into the playoffs. We got to play in the wild card against the Giants, though, who just beat us a few weeks ago. But that's all the time I got to record in this one. Next one, we will start the playoffs. And guess what? In the playoffs, the chaos wheel does not stop. So get ready for mayhem. But anyways, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends in my book. And as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace.